Meteorologist Brett Anderson here in the 1011 Weather Center. Happy Memorial Day, and overall it should be a pretty decent day. We may see a few fair weather clouds again pop up with the daytime heating, but otherwise we should see sunshine. Going to be a little breezy. Northwest wind 10 to 20, gusts around 30 miles per hour. As you can see as we head towards 5 o'clock, a few scattered clouds, mainly I think for western and southern Nebraska, but overall mostly sunny skies in eastern sections of the state. Generally clear skies and cool tonight. A lot of us will see lows in the 40s, lower 50s, which is a bit below average. Some patchy clouds for south central Nebraska early Tuesday. Otherwise, I think mostly sunny skies return on Tuesday. Maybe a little less wind, but still a bit of a north breeze from time to time around 10 to 15. But again, sunshine as we head into Tuesday afternoon with seasonal temperatures or at least near average temperatures for much of the state. I want to talk a little bit about the potential of severe weather over the next three days and the lack of it. So uh, that's certainly some good news as we head into Monday. Uh, we're basically not looking at any kind of pre precipitation. There might be an ice with a thunderstorm in northeast Nebraska, but a non-severe storm. Heading into Tuesday, not looking for any kind of thunderstorm activity across the state, dry weather. Uh, and then as we head into Wednesday, especially late Wednesday, there is a marginal risk for the Panhandle in far western and southwest Nebraska. So late in the day, there could be some isolated severe thunderstorms. Uh, maybe an isolated thunderstorm Wednesday night for places like Kearney and Broken Bow, but not expected to be severe. So the bottom line, we're at least eastern sections of the state, we're not expecting any kind of precipitation or thunderstorm activity through Wednesday. So moving on, <coughs> the precipitation over the next three days, apologize for that, I'm, I feel fine, it's just a little tickle in the throat, I don't understand. Anyway, three-day precipitation potential, looking at, uh, this is, again will go into Thursday morning, May 30th, so certainly not looking for much in the way of precipitation. <coughs> not looking for much in eastern sections of the state, western Nebraska, Again, as we head into Wednesday night to Thursday, we start to see the chance for some thunderstorms, so there will be some precipitation there. How about the next 8 to 14 days, June 3rd, June 9th? Looks like below average precipitation possible for much of the state, and we're going to see above average temperatures June 3rd through June 9th. Back to the pollen, I'll look for your Memorial Day Monday, looking at uh, low tree pollen, weed pollen, and grass pollen. If you are going to be doing out outdoor activities today, grab the sunscreen or uh, cover up because we will be looking at that burn time about 15 minutes lots of sunshine burn time 15 minutes without the sunscreen as we check out the wind speed wind gusts for the Lincoln area we do anticipate gusts to around 30 miles per hour as we head into our Monday afternoon so 81 the high temp temperature today in Lincoln the average high is 79 mainly sunny skies at northwest wind 10 to 20 with gusts between 25 and 30 miles per hour 80 in Seward 82 in Wilbur check out your average high temperatures for some select cities again for May 27th you can see most of us are in the mid to upper 70s and we're not going to be too far from that 81 in Lincoln today with 78 in Ord 80 in Grand Island Broken Bow 78 74 in Valentine 81 in McCook 81 today in Creek with 77 in New York 82 in Tecumseh 75 in O'Neill with 78 in Lexington 79 in Imperial lows tonight a little cooler 40s and 50s, 50 in Columbus, 52 in Lincoln, 49 in Lexington. High temperatures on Tuesday, more 80s, still some 70s, but generally 70s and 80s with 83 in Lincoln, 80 in North Platte, 77 in Valentine. And Wednesday, going to see a lot more 80s, still some upper 70s with 79 in Albion, 80 in Lincoln, and 80 degrees in Lexington. Here's the 10-day forecast. Uh, we stay dry in Lincoln through Wednesday. Then we start to see more unsettled weather for the end of the week with scattered showers and thunderstorms for Thursday and Friday, along with a cooling trend, mid-70s on Friday. As we head into the first weekend of June, meteorological summer beginning June 1st on Saturday, scattered thunderstorms continue for both Saturday and Sunday, upper 70s Saturday, lower 80s Sunday. And then into next week, some isolated storms Monday and Tuesday with mid-80s, and then next Wednesday looking dry and warm.